What is up everybody? This is Moritz here from Sections to once again and today I will be showing you this Parallax sectioner and how you can get it for your very own Shopify store and the nicest thing about this one is that it is 100% free. I'm guaranteeing you that. It's just the installation and the app and that's pretty much it. But besides that you don't have to pay for anything and I'm going to show you how you can customize it to your likings as well. So let's jump right into it. The first thing I did for this is that I headed on over to the Shopify app store where I did get the section store app. I simply open it up in the Shopify admin area and then here you can already find under newest releases and if you're a bit later to the video you can just use the search bar right here. You click on it and then the next step you simply just look on the right here and I already own it but you can pretty much click on get the section and then you have to head back to the my sections area of the app where you can find a collection of all the sections you're owning and then just simply add it to the theme you're using. In my case, it is the Dawn Light theme, but it does work on every theme. Don't worry about that. And then simply just open it up in the theme editor. And I've already done so. A nice thing I would like to tell you about this section is that even after you installed it, you can simply delete the app and still remain with the section because it's just copying the code inside your store. So it's not going to slow it down in any way. So let's get rid of this real quick, save it up so we can start completely from scratch. All the sections you can see in this store are also from section store. So definitely it's worth it to have a look inside it. Maybe you find something else you're going to enjoy. So I'm just going to pick this parallax, bring it all the way to the top. And now, of course, the first thing I would like to do is add an image to the whole thing because that is the main part of the section. So we're going to click on it right here. And here we're going to select an image and I would like to have, let's look for a nice one, scroll down a little bit, something a bit more cinematic looking. Yeah, let's go for this one. I think this will be perfectly fine for the parallax effect. Of course, you can adjust all the heights and everything else. If you're not happy with how the way it looks on mobile, you can simply upload a different image on mobile. And here you can already see the lovely look and parallax effect. And we can even add a little image overlay capacity so it's a little bit darker and the text is easier to read. And here we can do a lot of customizations to the positioning of the text, how much padding and content there is going to be. And here we can even decide the overlay color. So if you want to have it in orange, for example, to give it a bit of a more washed out look, that is also possible. Maybe let's go for that. I like this one. And yeah, here just some random margins and stuff like that. Always make sure to enable lazy load to optimize the speed for your website. So it's not going to slow your store down. We made sure we gave you all the options for that too. And here you can already see the text. We can customize that, the size, the color, whatever you prefer. So I'm just going to show you that it's updating live. And here we can also change this little line right here. Also the font, text size and whatever you name it is changeable too. And here we have the button as well, which is fully customizable too. And we can even set some other styles for it, depending on what theme settings you have. But I think this one looks quite nice with the arrow. And here we also have the possibility to change the background color of the button. Maybe let's stick for this brown. This is looking nice. And yeah, that is pretty much that. Maybe last thing I want to show you is that we can use this little eclipse here, for example, as well. But yeah, I'm not going to get into detail too much because at the end of the day, you're going to customize this thing to your brand guidelines of the store. So just get funky with it and play around a little bit. And yeah, let's have a fine look at it in the live version. If it's looking good, we're going to round this one up. It is working perfectly fine. And with that successfully being done, I wish you a good day and I hope you like it and peace out.